here I have the Unte, and thank you. I think that's how I say it. I, I might be saying the name wrong, but thank you for sending me your EC200 drone. I appreciate it and I can't wait to check it out. So this is one of those drones that has the land mode and the air mode. So on land mode, you can drift it around and glide it across the floor. And then in air mode, it flies like a regular drone. So let's check it out. Okay, here's a look of everything that's in the box. So we get a user manual right here. We get a screwdriver. We get a prop remover tool that you can put there and like pop the props off if you ever have to change them. You get one set of spare propellers. Here we have the controller, which the controller, it takes three AAA batteries. Some of the buttons are marked, but I think there's more features to this than what's marked. And then we get two USB chargers along with two 3.7 volt, 300 milliamp hour single cell LiPos. And then also in the drone, you get your third battery. So plenty of flight time with all three batteries. But here's the drone. It has that design where when it's flying, it flies like with the front end higher than the back end. And then when it's on the ground, it just glides on that. So this drone does come in two different colors. It does come in blue and then also red. So that was everything that comes in the box. So I'm gonna get all three of these batteries charged up and we're gonna have some fun with this. All right, it's time to fly the EC200. We're gonna set it up right here and we're gonna put the front facing away and that's for headless mode. Let's turn the controller on, turn that on, up, down, and that binds us. So the LEDs have a flashing pattern going here. If you do a short press on that button, that does a gyro calibration. If you do a long press, it'll shut those LEDs off. So that'll help with battery life if you wanna shut the LEDs off. So there's two ways to take off. The easiest, of course, is auto take off. <laughs> and there we go. Oh, I'm drifting away. It is altitude hold. I'm drifting away, so let's adjust the trim. The trim is right here. If you hold, there we go. Oh. Okay, that's a pretty good hold there. So you push this in and then you hit whatever direction you need to trim it. So let's land it same way you take off. You just hit the button, one key take off, one key land. And then you can also take off by just hitting up. And then you hit up twice and it'll, whoa, where are we going here? And then if you want to do an emergency stop, you just hold this auto take off, auto land button in. But you hold it in two seconds and it'll just shut off. Let's check out the speeds. Two beeps. Three beeps. Yeah, now it goes pretty good now in the third rate. <laughs> Whoa. All right, let's try the flips because it does do flips. There's a back flip. Let's do a front flip. Okay. And now let's roll to the left. Finally, we'll roll to the right. And yeah, those are some nice tight flips on that. Very easy to control, very responsive on the controls. So it does fly really, really good. So the only thing left is headless mode. And to get into headless mode, you just give it one tap on the left. So, Let's see, if I turn around, yep, even when I'm turning around, if I go to the right, and same, headless mode is just that. There is no head to the drone. So left will always be left, right will always be right. Same with forward and backwards. So that works pretty good. Let's get out of that and fly around. We'll see how much battery life we get out of just flying around in the third rate. And I'm gonna cut right to where this goes into low voltage and comes down and lands, just to save some time. You don't need to see me flying back and forth trying to run this battery out. Good thing that this is a ducted fan drone and you have the prop guards because I just bounced it off the garage door there. So now I am in low voltage. I can't do any flips. It's not letting me do flips, so I'm in low voltage. You can't really tell just because 
these LEDs flash all the time when, oh, there it is, and it just died. So flight time right there on the screen. It's a good thing we have three batteries. Now let's pop another battery in and let's test out land mode. All right, so we are on battery number two, and now we're gonna do land mode. And for land mode, all it does is it just skims across the floor. Laminate flooring will work the best. Now this floor, you can see it is, it's painted, it's finished. So this concrete floor will work as well. You just use your yaw to turn and you just use your forward to drive it. Your yaw control turns the drone. So this is the first rate. It is kind of struggling a little bit on this floor. So you can actually change the rate while you're in land mode. So you just hit, there we go. Now we're in a second rate. You can see it got a little bit faster, but let's go into the third rate. <laughs> now we're like cruising across the floor pretty good. So I'm just gonna run around here in the third rate and see how long until it stops going. a good run out of the battery in in land mode oh there it is that's it that's the battery there's one more thing I want to check out I want to check out if I can go from land mode while I'm sliding around into air mode all at the same time so good thing we got a third battery so let's get that in there there's the third rate okay now I'm gonna hit up twice on the sticks and it goes up in the air, okay. So let's bring it back down. And now we're back in land mode. Up, up, whoa! <laughs> okay, so you can, you can go right from land to air just by hitting up twice on the sticks. Let's see if you can hit the auto takeoff, if that puts you up in the air too. So I'm driving along, drive, Take off, <laughs> yeah. So you can do the auto take off while you're in mid drift and it'll just take off. Let's see if I can do this at the same time. Drift around, drift around and take off. <laughs> awesome. So one thing I noticed when I was just messing around with this, I was trying to go in reverse. So I've just been basically going in forward the whole time and making tight turns like this. But can you go in reverse? Well, I hit reverse and it pops the front end up like that. And then if you turn the yaw, you can kind of turn up. <laughs> so it does that reverse, it pops the front end up and you can do like a little wheelie or something. <laughs> All right, let's bring it in. So that was the Unte, again, I don't know if I'm saying it right, EC200. It works pretty good. This, this is a really fun drone. Really like the features that are on it and everything works like it's supposed to. Thanks Unte for sending this to me. But that'll do it for this video. Thanks for checking it out. Click the subscribe button so you can join me when I check out the next Ready to Run RC.